What's up, janitors? We got some special news today, some confirmation that Andrew Garfield is in the Spider-Man movie. Can't say 100% confirmation. I would like to say 99% confirmation that Andrew Garfield is in this movie. Uh, recently, Andrew Garfield did a interview with Variety where they were just harassing him with questions about Spider-Man because really that's their job. That's their job as journalists is to just harass the hell out of Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire and keep asking them questions that legally they're not allowed to answer until they just hate their lives, hate the fandom. And the ball, what up? <laughs> uh, but we got people on the inside, someone leaked a photo. You know, the other day it was a photo, then it was a, a blurry video, and today it's the most 4K I've ever seen in my life. It is, it is the clearest video that there could possibly be. It's like it came from the actual IMAX camera itself. It's Andrew Garfield, he's holding a railing, he's standing in front of a blue screen. I cannot show the video here. Sony, if you're already in here, I'm not showing it. Don't strike my channel. Go to my Twitter. And the reason I'm doing that is because I don't give a shit about my Twitter. Uh, Sony, you can strike my Twitter. I really don't care, I'll just build a new one. But I do care about my YouTube channel, so I'm not going to um, risk Sony copyright striking my YouTube channel because they've already brought the hammer down. They've already been striking Instagram channels and other YouTube channels. The Spider Fan Instagram account, which is the first place that I saw it, uh, they got striked. And so I don't feel like that happening to me. So I'm just going to tell you guys what it looks like. It doesn't look like a deep fake. Some people are saying it's a deep fake. I This doesn't look like a deep fake. His Adam's apple moves. His Adam's apple moves with him while he talks. You know, it just looks too real to be a deep fake. You know, I know what deep fakes look like. It looks like Luke Skywalker in The Mandalorian. That's kind of a joke, but not really. In the video, Andrew Garfield is talking to what looks like another Spider-Man because you can see his hand off to the side. And Andrew Garfield is mouthing the words, so what, you have like web blood? So he's talking to, he's clearly he's talking to Tobey Maguire because he's the only one that organically shoots the the webs from his hands and doesn't have the mechanical web shooters. And so they're trying to figure out how he's different from the other Spider-Mans. It just, it seems like a funny, a funny moment. Andrew Garfield has his mask off. So clearly he's revealing he's Peter Parker. Uh, and then if you look from another, another leaked photo from another angle, Tobey Maguire also has his mask off. So the two Spider-Mans are talking to each other and Andrew Garfield is making fun of Tobey Maguire for having web blood. Tobey Maguire is clearly going to correct him and be like, I don't have web blood. I just shoot the webs out of my hands. Uh, but Tom Holland, nowhere to be seen in this video. Tom Holland is also not seen in the other behind the scenes photos of this video. Been a lot of funny memes coming out about this video. The clearest video I've ever seen. This is the most HD shit ever. This is 4K. How did they get you in 4K? That ain't me. To imagine Kevin Feige is just losing it right now. They've done everything they can to keep this under wraps. And this is on Twitter right now. It's been on Twitter the entire day. I can't believe it's made it this far. It's been on Twitter for 12 hours. I do not know how Sony has not come in here and gotten rid of this tweet yet, but it's got 300,000 views on Twitter. You didn't hear it here first. You know, that's for sure. You didn't hear it from me at first. You know, if anything, you're probably hearing it from me last. But I want to report on this Spider Man news because I like Spider Man a lot. Uh, specifically, I. Grew up watching Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man religiously. Really enjoyed Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man as well. Not so much the story, uh, more the dedication, the acting, uh, the way Andrew Garfield looks. He just does a really good job of portraying Peter Parker, in my opinion, one of the best. And so he really got a bad end of the deal with his two Spider-Man movies, which in my opinion, were not very good. Amazing Spider-Man was okay. I have been doing a rewatch of all the Spider-Man movies lately, so maybe I'll do like a review on one of them or something. But it's really good to see Andrew Garfield back in the suit because he definitely deserved a way better send off than he was given. And it looks like you know, they're utilizing him correctly so far from what I could see because he's, you know, in this in this leaked video, it looks like he's saying something kind of funny. He's poking fun at Tobey Maguire. Some people are saying, well, what if this is a take from The Amazing Spider-Man 2? The Amazing Spider-Man 2, they used green screens, not blue screens. So you can see on the set for Spider-Man No Way Home, they're using blue screens, just like this leaked photo. And also in The Amazing Spider-Man 2, he was never talking to another Spider-Man. So that doesn't make sense either. 
but there's definitely probably three Spider-Mans in this movie, so it makes sense. Lots of good Spider-Man news coming out really right now. Uh, they just announced the Spider-Man game. Venom is going to be in it. That's going to be cool. Spider-Man's coming out in the Avengers game as well. I don't really play that game, but you know, I'm happy for you if you do play that game. Really, Spider-Mans are just feasting right now. We got Into the Spider-Verse coming out. We have Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield returning. Spider-Man No Way Home. We have the Spider-Man 2 video game coming out. And we have a Spider-Man storyline coming out for the Avengers game. This video is coming from Omar OVO24 is where I'm seeing this video. He got Andrew Garfield trending, essentially. He already tweeted, man, this is blowing up. I hope I don't get my account deactivated by Sony. Good luck with that. I just saw a meme today where it was like back then in 2004, in 2004, Spider-Man 2, when he gets his mask taken off and everyone's like, we won't tell, we'll keep your story secret. If that scene in Spider-Man 2 happened in 2021, uh, by the time he woke up on that subway and realized his mask wasn't on, every freaking person on that train's cell phone would have just been shoved in his face and down his throat and live streaming it and just everyone would have known that's why that movie's charming you know it has that nice little charm right before technology kind of came in and fucked up everyone's lives and now it fucked up the spider-man reveal all right see you next time janitor squad